Hey everybody, welcome back to Box Pop and Beauty. I am Michael. I'm Kendall. And today we have kind of a, not really a mystery box anymore. It's kind of out there in the world, but... It's a mystery to me. It's a mystery to her, and it's a mystery to what we got sequence-wise. In front of us, we each have what I believe to be the Awesome Fest Bundle. Oh, that's what we're doing? From Fig Pin. So, uh, if you don't know, Kendall and I live in Oregon. We had tickets to go to Emerald City Comic Con, and we were lucky enough to actually be ticket holders for Awesome Fest. We were going to be there and go there, and then everything happened. So, we obviously each had a ticket, so we were able to each order our own bundle. That being said, we obviously don't need to, so um, I'm definitely going to be looking to use these pins to acquire pins that I don't have in our collection or Funko Pops that I don't have in our collection. So if you are watching this video and you are looking for Awesome Fest pins, our contact information is down below or most of uh, the Fig Pin community knows me on Facebook already. So if you know me, find me and uh, yeah, let's get into it. Let's see what we got in our uh, Let's see what the, for those that haven't seen it, we'll show you what the Awesome Fest bundle is. And for those that have seen it, let's see if we got any really cool sequence numbers. Let's do it. Are we going through them at the same time? Yep. Oh, you got one of the prototypes. Cool. I didn't get one. Okay. So, first up, we'll just show you guys the logo. Okay. So. Is yours the same? Yep. This is the Fig Pin Awesome Fest logo. And it is freaking awesome. It's like this shield logo. Uh, first time they've done like a shield logo like this. So that's really cool. We each got one of those. So next up, we'll show you guys the mini that came in this bundle. And this is Dragon Ball Super Ultra Instinct Goku Mini. Should note, all of these pins are one of only 350. Does that go with this? No. So that's the thing. I was surprised I didn't get one. So this is really cool. Can I open it? Yeah. So this is a prototype of what is coming soon. And that is a uh, Get a Hero Complex Fig Pin single holder. It is a modular system. And spoiler alert, stay tuned. Um, I've been in contact with Get a Hero Complex, and we got some cool stuff coming to the channel. So stay tuned put it back in the box. for that. That is so cool. So basically, let me show you guys really quick. This system, what you do, it's really cool. So you attach this piece to your wall, and then you can switch out the different colors of the fig pin holders, and we'll show you at the next one. So I'll show you Wonder Woman. So the next one we have is Wonder Woman... And so what this does, I don't know if I could do it in this thing. I'm gonna take it out of plastic. I'm gonna have to take them out of plastic anyway to check the sequence numbers and stuff, but okay. Oh, it's just like a really good fit. But look at that. So you put that on your wall and then you can display your fake pins and you can just do modular of these single units. Uh, Get a Hero Complex is the first ever officially licensed big pin uh, accessory and it's really cool for them uh the, the company is so nice so so nice anyway next up we have one out of 350 bruce lee i was so excited that this pin is in this collection because if you guys know i recently got two of the original uh emerald city comic con black and white bruce lee fig pins um and those were limited to 500 this one's limited to 350 and the final one in here, which is quite possibly the coolest XL fig pin made. Um, there's actually, so there's three of these now. This is a glow in the dark version. And his, if you're curious, his uh, spine is what glows like when he does his like energy blast. That's what glows in the dark. So we'll check the sequence numbers for our uh, Awesome Fest bundles and we will be right back. One hour later. Okay, as always, takes forever, but we'll be really quick about this. Our Godzilla 
Again, all of these are out of 350. So we have one Godzilla that's 236 and one Godzilla that is 213. We got a Wonder Woman that is 62, which is pretty cool, pretty low number. And we got a Wonder Woman, which is 243. Um, we then got a Goku Ultra Instinct that is number 286 and a Goku Ultra Instinct that's number 71. So again, a pretty low one there. Uh, Bruce Lee, we got a 312 and a 51. So Bruce Lee was our lowest number pin. And then our shield logos were number 308 and number 107. So again, really cool. I'm glad um, that Figpin still dropped these for people uh, especially because at first it didn't seem like they were going to, but I'm glad they did. Really cool. Uh, big shout out. Congratulations to get a hero complex for these uh, proto 3D printed prototypes. Really looking forward again. Stay tuned. We got something big coming uh, with get a hero complex. So uh, we really hope you enjoyed this video. We appreciate the hell you being here. And again, like I said in the beginning, we got two sets because, you know, we each had a ticket. Uh, I don't need two of each of these. So I'm definitely looking to make some trades. We are trying to finish our logos. Um, there's a couple other pins out there we want. There's some Funko Pops that we want. Uh, like she wants the Rocky Horse set of Funko Pops. So again, there's stuff out there. So if you're interested in buying or trading, please reach out to us and let us know. And until next time, we will see you later. Bye, everybody.